I've got two more people I want to uh, introduce, and then I want to open it up to my clients, my kingdom citizens, my loyal, loyal people that have, you guys have been getting results. You're doing velocity banking. You're doing infinite banking. You're rediscovering your authority as an entrepreneur. You're, you're 10xing your business. You're fixing your credit with Brittany. You're doing marketing with Alex. You're learning how to become a public speaker with Alexa. I mean, you're, you're just, right? It's, it's, maybe it's a little hectic at first. I totally get it, totally understand. But when we're able to come together and really dialogue and see what solutions, what problems can we provide solutions to that help us move forward and improve the entire ecosystem, okay? So with that being said, uh, Sebastian, are you available? I am here. Good evening. Hello, Kingdom Man. How's everything going? All is well. Thank you. Thanks for having me. Awesome. Awesome. So, guys, most of you probably already know who Sebastian is as well, but um, our relationship also started early, uh, mid-2018. I was very interested in building my business credit, obviously doing Velocity Banking, starting a business, building my personal credit. So I got Brittany doing my personal. I got Sebastian doing the business. Come to find out Sebastian and I, we also share the same faith. We're very kingdom oriented, uh, you know, Christian oriented, you know, we got Christian values. Most of us in here do have faith. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, most of us, I do tend to attract that, that crowd. Um, and so we're able to really go have deeper discussions in terms of our faith and, and what, what really drives us from within. So it's awesome to be able to have those conversations with my partners. It's not always business. Sometimes it's just, you know, practical, simple questions. And that's what I kind of want to be able to um, have with my clients as well. Um, I know most of you guys that get on calls with me that are uh, clients of mine, it's usually always numbers, right? What are your numbers? What are your numbers? What are your numbers? What are your numbers? Where are you at? Where you want to be? Where are you going? Where are you headed? So with that being said, uh, Sebastian and I connected early 20, uh, yeah, early 2018. And he, he said that I could, you know, be an affiliate, promote his stuff after I was, you know, getting results. And he's really, uh, I want to say about a hundred people as well have at least landed on your website that are clients of mine paid you they're working with you they're learning from you you just recently created a youtube channel so um i have not had any negative uh feedback from of my clients working with you no issues that's awesome same with steve same with alexa same with um alex and Brittany. i mean it seems like everybody they know what they're getting into prior you know and that's what I really like is really just arming you guys with all the information in advance before you make that financial commitment. You know, so with that being said, Sebastian, uh, can you please introduce yourself if you'd like to share a testimony and add something to the conversation this evening? The floor yes, thank is yours. You. Thank you. Thank you. So, yeah, thanks. Uh, um, as Denzel said, yeah, I mean, just to just to, you know, give you some flowers, Denzel, um, you know, talking to. I don't know, hundreds of thousands of people over the last 10 years, uh, helping them with financing for their businesses. Um, I speak to a lot of people who say they're going to do things and they, you know, have big plans. And I don't know, I, I can count on maybe one or two hands, how many people actually do what they say and then actually go further and beyond to, um, to do way more. And, and Denzel is one of those people. When I first met him, I think you were just launching your channel. And I was like, okay, let's see what this young guy does. And then sure enough, look where he is. And then obviously you're just getting started. So it's definitely an honor um, to, to, to see that and to, to be able to you know, be a testimony to your uh, success. And um, thank you for having me here. So um, just really briefly, um, for the last eight going on nine years, I guess, I've been the director of financing at Orange Fi. And on that side, what we do is we, we help folks get access to financing, everything from SBA, 7A, um, you know, to 504, to equipment financing, asset-based lending, unsecured funding, startup funding. I'd say probably more than 70% of our clients are startups. That's where really what, what we target. And uh, we kind of uh, slipped into the business credit coaching because we, we started having a lot more clients, <clears throat> excuse me, who um, 
were expecting to be able to access funding on, um, on their uh, business credit because they'd been in business 15 or 20 years. And unfortunately, when we looked, they just, just didn't have any business credit. They never really were intentional. And so we just started uh, teaching kind of just organically, just because of the need. And, um, you know, our motto is literally to educate, advise, fund. And so, you know, both sides kind of complement each other. The Orange Phi side is our funding side. And then the business credit coaching is business credit 101. And like Denzel said, um, you know, I'm kind of following, you know, his lead and just watching what he's doing and started my channel, uh, the approved guy and, um, you know, finding it very difficult to, to stay on top of like new content and managing clients. It's very challenging. And um, just hired Alex. Alex is awesome. So I'm happy to start working with him. Um, Look yeah, at that. Yeah. That's awesome. I like that. I like hey, that. Hey, that. Agent, Sorry, if I could jump in. I didn't see if you were, I didn't see you on the call. I mentioned Brittany, but yeah, have a good night. Yeah, man. Thank you, brother. Uh, yeah, it signed up with Steve uh, Parisi as an as agent with IBC Global. Um, you know, just trying to do as much as I can to, to help my clients with all of these uh, great products and services. Um, you know, just a testimony, I guess the, the thing that really, you know, drives me or gives me passion is helping people overcome their mental obstacles or barriers that are stopping them from stepping into their purpose. That's really what drives me and gives me excitement. So teaching the, the financial literacy and, and business credit and, and helping people get financing, it's, it's awesome. But what I love doing is really helping people overcome their mental barriers. So I have a client right now, one of one of uh, Denzel's uh, referrals. Um, you know, about two three weeks ago, we talked, and she was thinking about she wanted to start a business, and uh, she was only gonna, thinking about doing this multi level level marketing business. And when I asked her like, what's the main main motivator behind it? You know, she was like, well, I can make a lot of money. And I said, well, you know, how much do you really love this business and this product? She's like, well, you know, it's okay. I said, well, you know, that's great. You should still do that. But, but why not really think about, you know, what gifts do you have and talents do you have that you really love and that you're good at? You know, um, I always tell people like me, you know, I love singing, but I'm no good at it. So I'm never going to make any money there. But, um, but she, in her, in her uh, humbleness said, well, you know, the only thing that I really love doing is sewing. I can't really make any money. there." And I was like, what do you mean? You know, I, I found this guy on, on YouTube who, was doing very well for himself teaching people how to hula hoop if somebody could make a business and you know make a good living teaching people how to hula hoop because he's really good at it and he loves doing it he found a market for people who want to hire him to teach them how to hula hoop you know well you can do the same thing so she she called me about two three weeks later after we really talked about purpose and just you know finding you know what was her her uh, her, her gift and she said I, I figured it out you know i love the carnival and I love sewing and I always, you know, promote these car the carnivals. She's from the Caribbean. So I'm, I want to start a business where I'm going to promote my sewing services to create costumes for the carnival and simultaneously promote the carnival. <laughs> I was like, that's a great idea. That's perfect. It's, it's a win-win. Awesome. There's a demand with the carnival. There's a demand with the sewing. It's perfect marriage. So this is a type of um, client that I love to work with. You know, again, she was stuck. She didn't know what to do. She was just thinking about making money. And uh, it is just really exciting to see that she's going to start doing something that she loves, that she's really good at. And uh, I'm excited to see how that unfolds. So um, that's me, the approved guy. Thanks for having me. Thank you, Sebastian. Really appreciate you sharing that, that story right there. You know, making money is very important. I mean, that's pretty much all I talk about on my channel for the most part is the money, right? But when you tap into your skills, gifts, and talents, you know, your, your, your gifts will make room for you on this, on this earth and the money will come, right? It's just a matter of being very tactical and, and strategic with your gifts. You know, it's not just a matter of sewing. You need to also be able to charge, right? You can't just be given for free. You're going to end up broke. It's like, you know, anybody that wants to start any type of business, there's got to be a, a plan behind it. Some, some process, it can't just be follow your passion and, and God will provide. <laughs> Wait a minute. Let's not put it all on, on God just for a sec. He does want us to have faith, but also some works as well, yeah. right? We, we need the strategic process. We need to be humble enough to listen to others, to feed into our brain so that we can execute on our goals. So thank you for adding that to the conversation, Sebastian. With that being said, um, that is all of my uh, partners that showed up here today. 
Um, so thank you guys for being here. It's so cool to have all you guys like at, this is so much fun. Every one of you guys here at once um, throughout the months, I'm always like trying to keep up with you guys. And it's just so cool to be able to kind of bring everybody into one ecosystem. And I really encourage all of my partners to connect with each other. You guys all offer something that I've personally purchased, used, invested in, got results. So I don't see why it can't crisscross, you know, just like what Alex was saying about Brittany and Sebastian about Alex. I mean, and then Sebastian with Steve, it's cool stuff, cool stuff. 